Hello everyone, welcome back to Looney Bin. My name is Looney and it is time for some Hall Life Reaction on, on Hall Life Reaction Wednesdays and we will be doing the best of Hollow Ian August. This is a compilation by the very talented and very good compilation maker known as Jello Clips. So definitely go give Jello Clips a like, subscribe, watch their content, support them and uh because they make fantastic compilations and uh, they really deserve uh as many subscriptions and views as they can get so uh thank you again jello clips and hopefully you enjoy my reaction as well and i can't wait to get started because there's some um, stuff that happened in august let's just put it that way so uh let us begin i don't know what i'm looking at i i i clicked on the video and I immediately saw this I don't know what I'm looking at but you know what Fauna no notes keep ha keep handling the whatever it is that you're doing all right let's begin <laughs> oh well she was kissing herself um well who loves you more than just who loves you more than you right <laughs> Alright, Fauna, that's interesting. I've lost gallons to you. I can't believe you would do I'm this. Gonna, I'm gonna wind you back. Come here. Me too! Come backwards, here. Backwards. 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 Come here. Backwards. No! No! Ah. Oh. Hello. Cecilia? <laughs> yes. How are you today? Oh, I am good, thank you. And I you? hate this. I wanna wind her back now. Well, no, 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 no. I'm gonna pilot her. I am Cecilia. I am a stupid, stupid robot. I love Gigi very much. I don't. No. Okay, that, that, that's all. <laughs> oh, wow. What? Wow, that's where she had the last straw. Please stay. Please stay. Please stay. Turn my. Quit crying, baby. What is crying? Why are we okay. so mean? Okay. Okay. He'll be fine. Oh, she's smiling. <laughs> It's okay. Gigi, stop staring at her. What a freaking... Look, she's all sad and stuff. She's there, smiling. There. She's smiling. She's playing Aww. you. There, there. Oh. 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 She only plays thing. the violin. What do you want about? She won't she's she's not playing me. Alright, well, that was a lot to unpack because I... Okay, so if I got that correct... Cecilia was saying or doing something. Um, Marora was not happy with it and decided that they should wind her back to, I guess, factory reset. <laughs> I'm, I'm assuming that's what was happening there. And um, uh, Gigi was like, no, I like, you know, joining in the fray. Elizabeth was, you know, just being, you know, stoic, you know, just standing there being, you know, as stoic as possible. And they rewinded Cecilia back to factory reset, and something happened again that Roar was not happy with. And Gigi decided to take the reins because um, she wanted to become Cecilia, and then she bullied her. She essentially just told Cecilia, Why are you crying? <laughs> Which is always a savage thing to say to anybody, especially if they start crying. Um, well, I they were they were watching the um the the Hall Life concert that they had um in New York and um I I'm just baffled by like what, <laughs> what in, I'm like I I okay so there's definitely context missing which I don't know what I've seen this happen I've seen like them moving around I seen like a clip of that or something like maybe on Twitter or something I saw something I don't know what it was um and I I still got nothing for it so it's like all right well Clearly, something happened that made Roro upset, and they decided to factor reset Cecilia, and Gigi became a bully. That's what I got from all that. I don't know if that's exactly what happened, but let me know in the comments. All right, thanks for. Also, oh, I know about this. <laughs> I know about this uh, comment that uh, this super chat and comment by Gora. I know about it. It's it's interesting. Coming, thanks for coming. What did you say? I've lost gallons to you. Huh? I hope you find me. Okay. That is a very famous clip of that super chat and Gura's response. Now, my take on it, my theory is that Gura did not understand 
what in the world that Super Chat was talking about. She read it with um, not realizing what exactly, you know, was happening. And either she... And I don't think she actually understood what that person was saying. But it's also Gur who also is like very... Um, she's very... She's very knowledgeable about certain Yabai and Meme Lord stuff. I don't think that's a meme in general. But like I think deep down she did kind of know what this person was saying. But essentially uh, for those who do not know. I've lost Gowns too essentially means that he... Uh, that this person... Um, uh, yeah, what's the what's the most say so way of saying this? Uh, what is the most say so way of saying this? Uh, this person relieved himself um, centrally um, to Gura, which by which again, it's it, you never want to admit that aloud to anybody, no matter who it is. It, it's very cringe. It's very weird. It's borderline sexual harassment if you ever say that to anybody. Right, so yeah, he, he, yeah, essentially that, and um, and Gura, I guess, just did not understand, or she did, and decided to answer it in a way that's just like, uh, all right, <laughs> I don't know, that's my take on it, but we'll see. Uh, I, I don't know. It was a very weird super chat, and you know what? She handled it very gracefully. Maybe, like I said, she didn't know exactly what this person was talking about and you know what that's still like the best response you can get you can give if you're a content creator and someone sent you that, that kind of super chat <laughs> yo oh um that is a arm uh it's not an arm drag that's they yeah, haven't done that yet uh but this is a grapple okay <laughs> I've seen this before. I know. I know all about the Fuwawa wrestling. Uh, they even got a, a tweet back from, I believe, a tag team from AEW. I want to say. I don't remember if it's AEW WWE, but they did get like tweeted back about this. It was, it was very adorable. <laughs> Those are the Daniel Bryan kicks. Yeah. Yes. 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 Okay, not really. She has to be on the on her knees in order for the kicks to happen. Okay, just to let you know, I don't think anyone has ever used a hammer in wrestling. I could be wrong though. I haven't seen anyone use a hammer, but that was just mostly just Super Smash Brothers hammering, hammer time. Ready? Huh? <laughs> Because she's your natural enemy, uh, Bibu. <laughs> I've seen this also. It's uh, it, it was very fun to see uh, Bibu go into this and creating like this, you know, this. I guess R uh, Elden Ring RPG or maybe like um, that uh, Double May Cry esque type of thing. It's it was very fun watching it. Oh, I'm tired. Whatever. Oh, you're tired. Okay then. <laughs> you you got rocked you rock no you rocked is is positive but like you got rocked something like that you know you got be booed or whatever that's her fault what her fault what? uh if you come with me i can protect you from even death itself she can't get you in the realm of the immortals oh you absolute uh, uh, but, but no! Oh. <laughs> the others won't be very happy with you. And you think that matters to me? Why? <laughs> but, but, no, no. Oh, you're okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Marine just saying banana while while Nerissa was saying some, some like Shakespearean shit and Callie also just looks like she's confused and has no idea what the hell is going on and she, Marine just says banana that, that, 
That is just so funny. The timing of it is fantastic. Oh my goodness gracious. But uh I there I'm assuming Narissa was reading some sort of fan fiction she wrote before she joined Hollow Life. I'm assuming that's what it is. Uh because I have no idea what the hell that just happened. Hey, Joshi, I have a secret message I need to tell you. Please all come right, with me. Right, what is it? We have to kill God, yeah. Joshi. God Is that even possible? God is trying to kill us both, you know? I'm sorry, Joshi. I see how it is. I see how it is. Then, yo, what up? I want to be a criminal. Oh, you want to be a criminal? So now, Sky Blue, your first ever mission is to kill the monkey. The monkey, monkey. loves cute girl. You're gonna lure him into an alleyway, and then you're gonna go pop, pop. Sky Blue, I show you my secret technique. Oh, my secret technique. I found the monkey. Hello. Oh, hello there, sister. Mr. Wow, Monkey, you looking... can I have a chit chat with you? Wait, where are you taking me? Man, this feels like a freaking, like, like, what's uh, happening? What? What? Wait a fucking second. What are you doing, man? Uh, man, what's your problem? Just, just, just stay there. <laughs> uh, sense. Oh. How dare you Monkey. kill my fucking student? Monkey, Mr. Pinkman. Surprise, motherfucker. Yeah, oh, no. No. What in the what in the K drama was that? <laughs> that had so many plot twists. That's not like holy oh my god, that had so many plot twists. That's insane. Oh my goodness gracious, like I <laughs> That was some K drama shit. <laughs> That was like some actual GTA stuff, which I'm assuming that game was GTA. I've seen um, the girls starting to play it. I'm assuming the GTA. I know I don't play GTA as uh, at all, so I don't know if that was. I think someone told me it was GTA, but like that was some K drama shit. And um, yeah, and oh my goodness gracious, I know exactly who this is. Uh, it is. It, it, I can tell you right now, it's not uh, a former uh, member of Niji Sanji. That starts with the letter P and ends with the uh, ends with Omu. By the way, guys, normally for like off collab karaoke, I rap the lyrics in a way that like there's <laughs> split lyrics. I, but no time for that this time. No time. So we're just gonna like tap each other's shoulders. You can times. tap me anytime. I was thinking about tapping your shoulder, and then I thought about tapping something else. But... Kiara, you 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 horny girl. I tap that ass. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Kiara, so seductive. Hmm. Oh, I know, for the next one, you have a lot of people watching, right? Yeah. I want you to raise up the audience. Can you, like, cabby on the camera and then and then give us your best line? Yeah, do that. Yeah, Is yeah, this yeah. like your secret fantasy, babes? Uh, no, just do it, just do it. I'm in charge here, okay? <laughs> ah, that's what you want, huh? But tonight, I'm using you. <gasps> Fury! What? Oh, oh, oh. What? Wow. Are you okay there, my girl? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ah, oh, well, good. <laughs> You're not supposed to be rizzing Narissa. You're supposed to be rizzing everybody else, but... She's always riz, though. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh... <laughs> That definitely was a little bit of the uh, doki 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 over here. Um, Capadon um, is a very, very good uh, technique to get the heartbeat racing. Uh, don't randomly do it. That is, could be considered sexual harassment. Uh, <laughs> but I will say, I, I'm going to make a few comments here. One, doesn't everyone just cabin on Bibu anyway? She, I mean, she's so short, like... I feel like everybody could just cap it on Bibu and like she gets capped on every single day unintentionally. Um, Narissa, well, we, we all know about Narissa and how like we just know. You know, it's Narissa. She she gets excited about anything like that, so and I like the fact that Fuomoko, the uh <laughs> I believe that they, they are the only Japanese members of this group. Uh, we're confused about the Cabadon. I, I feel, I feel like that's, I feel like the Cabadon has been so highly, like, um, uh, fantasized more by the West than actually Japanese people, but I could be wrong. It's just funny. <laughs> I, I just found the whole thing fucking funny. What am 
I showing? Oh no, my arm, this arm, the other arm. Oh no, what am I doing? <laughs> Okay, uh, in regards to the Shiori thing, um, I'm not an armpit guy, I'm not an armpit guy, um, but she did show that ass. Uh, as for this, this doesn't hurt. I'm sorry to say, but this does not hurt at all. You're just pulling them back, and literally, you know, it, this doesn't actually hurt unless she twisted the arms. It doesn't. You just literally just you know just doing this and then moving it's literally nothing like her like mokoko herself uh, moving like that will probably hurt her more than whatever or than for while we're trying to do so but if you really want to hurt them if you're ever in like a wrestling position like this what you would do essentially is either put a knee to the back and do it or put a foot to the back and do it that's how you hurt the arms this doesn't necessarily do that uh the only one really hurting themselves will be Mokoko, because if she moves around and tries to pull in the opposite direction that for uh that for is pulling, you know, then it will hurt. But like, I don't think this does anything. Uh, I could be wrong though. I've never been in this position, but it just to me, just looking at it logically, and I think just in general, it doesn't actually do anything. You have to like put your foot or your knee on the back and do that in order to be effective because you're supposed to pull. You know, this way, and then you're supposed to use your foot or your knee to push, you know, the person forward while you pull their arms back. That's how, you, that's, you know, literally stretching them out. But this doesn't do anything. I'm sorry. I'm criti I'm critic. I'm like going in depth on a fucking wrestling thing <laughs> that they're clearly not hurting each other. Okay. What she just did there was an actual wrestling move, the STF. I believe it's called something else, but it was made mostly famous by John Cena, who, um, if you've never seen, that's you know that's normal. You, you can't see him, but like that is that was legit his finishing move in WWE, uh, his finish submission move in WWE. <laughs> Okay, a uh, chair shot to the back, that's fine. Uh, most of the time, it's, uh, you know, it doesn't hurt at all, no matter what kind of chair you use. Now, if you slam someone in the fucking head with it, it hurts. There, there's a whole thing about it in WWE. But that, that, that was like, you know, in wrestling, to avoid getting really hit by that, you are forcing the person, and the person himself has to just, you know, sell it that they got hit. Um, yeah, also, did uh, does the STF hurt it can especially if you because you're locking the legs and then putting your hand around his face and you're basically pressing them back yes it will hurt uh but wrestling or um, wrestlers especially john cena who did it don't actually do it you know to the point where like it hurts usually at wrestling and i'm kind of giving stuff away in wrestling although at this point i think everybody knows that wrestling is more choreographed than you know stuff like that uh, usually if someone does a move that really hurts um, unless they're doing it in te uh, in, with, with intention, you know, that's a dick move. But usually if the wrestler who's getting a move done on feels too much pressure or feels like it actually starts hurting, what they do sometimes is that they pinch a wrestler, you know, or, you know, pinch a wrestler or something like that, telling them, yo, yo, ease up on it. And that's a way that they could be protective and then, you know, they ease up a little bit. Most of the time, the reason why it looks like it hurts is because, the, you know, the wrestlers are acting and, you know, making you think they're actually putting a lot of pressure, but normally not. And here we got Fauna kissing her. Or herself. Hi, Fauna. Come here, Fauna. Give me a kiss. I'll kiss you. I'll kiss you. <laughs> no, don't. Just pay attention to me. You don't need her. You don't need her. You have me. Fauna-ception, I'm assuming Fauna was reacting to her reaction, to her reaction of like her, I'm assuming her debut stream or something, I don't know, but I think that's what was happening there, I, Fauna, you know, no notes, keep living your truth. What'd she say? Offer comfort. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
Wow, that escalated quickly. <gasps> Ina! Oh. Good morning. Good evening. This is Inoai Inani. Wow. Ina, can you give us some art tips? Of course, of course. All you have to do is flip it. And you see all your mistakes when you flip it. I didn't even notice that this side was just so terrible. This is what you do to ensure symmetry. Symmetry. What are you guys doing today? You went to the park? <laughs> Going outside? I could never. No! Uh, no, Bay. I'm sorry, but you did not do a great Ina impersonation. You tried, though. You tried. I mean, better luck next time. I do wonder, though, will Elizabeth ever do something like this where she, she takes over someone's stream? I mean, she could. She has those, you know, she, she could imitate voices. It's possible. Okay, I'll continue with Lala. On, on her oh. head, we have... <laughs> Kiara committed the ultimate sin, calling Mo uh, calling Mokoko Fuwawa. Green Justice Woman. <laughs> Thank you for the. <laughs> what is it called? Definitions? No. De def definitions? Definators? No, not defamation. Defin definer. Defin defining definers. Definers. Yeah, yeah. English is hard. You know. You know what else? <laughs> okay, Cecilia, don't say it. English is hard. Um. Uh. I. I all right. You don't know what else is hard, Rora? Rora? Do you know what? You know what else? The cucumbers that I put in your fridge! <laughs> Got him. Hey guys, you mind All if right. I put a little paper cut on the back of your balls and just squeeze them out? Oh. Oh. Why? Oh. Oh. Oh my. Oh. No, 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 no. I. Oh. The, oh, oh th this is like a fucking Usopp spell. Oh. Fuck. I don't even... Just, th just the idea of it. Oh, my goodness. Why would Nerissa ever think of it like that? I know she doesn't mean what, she, what I'm thinking she's meaning, but, like, first off, it's Nerissa. Who knows what she's thinking? Um, But also just, oh, fuck. I do not... I That was not a good sentence to hear. If you're a guy, you understand. Never mind. That is actually a good wrestling move. Um, I don't remember what it's called, but it's an actually a good wrestling uh, move. Do you give up? Eh, I feel like Fuomoku gave up too easy. Clearly, she loves her sister so much that she let her win. For a while, I think would have would have had her. Out of the mountain, what is the art winds? Draw boobs. Why did I? How did I know that? I was thinking that. I was I was gonna say my art, my art. Oh my god. Oh my god. I was literally gonna say the same thing. I thought she was gonna say something else. I was going my art. Tip wisdom is draw boobs. I'm like, wow, what the? <laughs> oh my goodness gracious! I did not, I did not view this before. I did not, view, never seen this clip before. My God! Oh, holy shit! I have brain rotted. <laughs> my brain has rotted to the depths of the internet. I, I, I have, I. Have, nothing else to say but that was fun thank you so much for watching my reaction hopefully you enjoyed it i'll see you guys on next reaction day which will be sunday so thank you so much and i'll see you guys soon uh panties for some reason but yeah i'll see you guys next time all right bye bye